Here is the first violin part for the Prelude and Fugue in E minor, <clears throat> attributed to Johann Sebastian Bach, raised by John Levitt. Okay, we have one sharp in the key signature of E minor, okay, and with that it's also going to come many accidentals, okay, and as I look, like measure 14 for example, okay, that A sharp is going to carry on to the second A sharp in that measure, okay, we have that in, uh, let's see, 7, 8, 9, and 10, we have that C sharp, the last one's going to be a C sharp, and so on, so watch those as you go through. Here we go, ready? And one... tempo and meter one two three talk about measure 67 okay so you have this you got that first finger going back and forth very quickly so there's a thing called half position where you could play the first E in 67 with first finger and then replace that kick that back and put second finger on the E and now the slur with the D sharp is very quick and then the C sharp would be a four. Okay, back to a one on that slur. So some advice there. That's probably what I would do. Kind of a chromatic fingering is what it's called. All right, so we have one, two, three. Second measure, two, three.
it's going to diminish weather, getting softer. Okay, and just watch how much bow on that second to last measure. Uh, you're probably going to want to use more and more bow on the second and third half notes in the next to last measure. Good luck.